Oh no, we're starting off just like we did last time. <laughs> he had one. I don't know if it. Yeah, it's off. Hey guys, what is going on? Andy Bean, Beaner Outdoors. So today we're on the pond. We're trying to catch ourselves some bass. I got my uh, fiance right there in the background. She's in her kayak and got old Ben here with me. He's already had two bites and we've only been on the water, what now? Probably about a minute, Ben? 30 seconds. 30 seconds, okay. And, uh, but now today I'm gonna, I bought some new stuff that I'm gonna try out and each one that I switch out, I'm gonna show y'all uh, what it is. That way, try to help you out with like gathering decent tackle for your arsenal see what works and what don't work so stay tuned and uh let's get out there oh yeah he gave a good kick he looked half -back. oh yeah. yeah a little bit above average yeah buddy Ben's Ben's catching a bunch of fish and I'm trying to get one tied on but I'm gonna try this out real quick uh, rebel is the name of it it's a grasshopper uh, just a little yellow grasshopper called the crick hopper so we're gonna try or I'm gonna try it see how it works give it a few casts and see if it can't deliver for us I can't tie my lure on for Ben catching fish. Way out there. Man, he must have hit it as soon as it hit the water. He's fighting it. He's putting some bow. Oh, yeah. We gotta just head back this way. It's, it's all weeds up here. It's all I can. Oop. Oh. Well, old grasshopper, it does work. Hey, he's decent. I'll take him. Pick that thing off. Never mind. You freaking tail. Thank God I didn't get stung by that. What was it? Oh, one of those barbed ones? Yeah, see it? Oh, I was thinking, the, the ones I was thinking about, they got like. Ladies and gentlemen, I have caught a world record to the point when I set the hook, he skipped across the water. <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, this one right here, it's great. It catches fish, but if you're looking for a bigger fish, it will catch bigger fish, but also you're going to catch a ton of little small fish on it. And that's the reason why right there is these tiny little hooks. You're gonna hook the smaller bass. I just hooked one that was only about that long. And yeah, so he was so small when I set the hook, I actually skipped him across the water. But uh, yeah, this Rebel uh, Crick Hopper is the name of it. It gets it done, it gets out there and it catches it. But for big fish, if you're just targeting big fish, this is gonna target all size fish. So. Yeah. Man, he didn't fight much. It'll be the size that he is. Folks, I'm switching it up. Now I'm going to this thing right here. I just saw it in the aisle and I was kind of like, you know what? I'm going to try it. If it don't work, hey, it don't work. Whatever. But you don't know until you try and you get out there. So let's put this thing on. Yeah, 
grass there, weren't we? Dude, we have. And normally, like this time. Oh, yes. Please. <laughs> Dude, I got all that on video. <laughs> like. Oh, oh, he catches some perch. That's an eater. That's why you want to call it, huh? Yeah. That was funny. Well, I think we hit a dry spell. Yeah, we hit a dry spell. Bam! I felt it nibbling. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I'm taking this one off. Uh, I mean, it could catch fish, but the action for it and just how it's working, it just, I don't know, I'm not a huge fan, of course. You know what you pay for it, it was only like $1.97 at Walmart. All right. Next one is that thing right there. Kyla makes it. Some people call it Rapala, Rapala, however you want to call it. But where I come from, everyone I know calls it Rapala or Rapala. So, but that's what we're going with. It's an ultralight minnow finesse sinking the ULM6. So we're going to see how it works. I mean, Rapala makes good stuff. And so we're going to see how, how it goes. So ladies and gentlemen, we're out here on the pond, getting out there like usual, doing what we love to do. And um, today, our episode is brought to you by uh, Chad Eversol with 3Max8. Um, Chad is a huge supporter of this channel, and he's the reason I'm trying all these new lures and stuff. Uh, um, he's just big supporter and look him up chad chad eversall with three max eight chad eversall with three max eight don't swim at me little sun perch whatever i had before that it sounded and looked just about looking at the water, it looked like a decent fish. What, sweetie? Alright. Is that a fish that came up right there? Yeah, I just tried to catch it. <laughs> I was going to say, you put it on this right on it. Well, there you go, where'd you go, fella? And you might have got him. We got one fish in here. Crunk's fighting another one. He sounds like he's giving you a little bit of a little bit of a fight. He ain't decent. Today. Oh man. Found another con about these. What? Yeah, it hooked. Uh, sorry, straightened it out almost. So if you look at this hook, you can see how much it's been straightened out. Like, look at. So look at this one, and then look at this one. And you can see it's really been straightened out good. There, finally. Yeah, I got one. I don't think it's much, but. Ooh, he, he swallowed her. Yeah. 
got it out of them. Took me a little bit. So I hit the, uh, what I thought I was hitting, the stop button. But I hit the record button. So, that fish being caught, I didn't get any of it.